Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today is another vlog, this time in English and in rather festive style as well. I think I will call this video my second vlogmas for 2022. The first one was from Poland in Polish and that is my last video and unfortunately I don't have enough time to record a series of Christmas inspired videos as some, some creators do here on the YouTube platform and if you watch me uh, for a while uh, you already know I love this type of videos the same as I love Christmas and everything that surrounds it so yes i wish i could record more of this kind of videos but hey ho we will start with two and maybe in the future there will be more okay so to bring you up to speed i'm currently on my way to have my christmas manicure with the one and only gabrysia she lives right next to me literally five minutes walk so very convenient and yes i know i could do it myself but first of all it takes me ages um, to do one hand after another plus it is great to be a customer for a change and relax so yes i'm doing my nails first and this weekend will be particularly christmasy as later today we are planning to visit a christmas tree farm to pick up our christmas tree yes we are a real christmas tree team i wonder what team you are in guys do you prefer real christmas tree or artificial ones please leave the comments underneath this video as to be honest i don't mind either i grew up having real christmas tree at home but i don't think i would mind a fake one um, in fact they are doing them so well these days that sometimes they look even better than the real ones so yes please feel free to leave your thoughts in the comment section underneath this video but long story short we are going to pick up a real tree today and start to pre prepare uh, everything for Christmas, all the decorations. And this afternoon we are also going to see the Newbury Christmas Carnival at the Racecourse. Apparently it's really impressive and worth visiting. So I've booked us uh, the tickets and again it's a walking distance from where we live. So we will just walk there and check it out. And hopefully I will be able to film some little clips from there uh, as well and then tomorrow I am heading over to London with my friend Anna so I thought this weekend will give me the perfect opportunity to film a cozy Christmas inspired vlog plus December is a very intense time uh, for me when it comes to my work at the studio so I really treasure weekends like this when I can simply enjoy the festive season with my family and close friends and as you can probably see we have the coldest weekend in England so far. It's frosty and it's freezing. So yes, we will have to properly wrap up for all this weekend's activities. Okay, I'm nearly at the Gabrysia studio, so I will catch up with you uh, in a little while. So after the nails, loving the sparkly color, very Christmassy of course, we are on our way to pick up the Christmas tree. And we are at the plantation, hopefully you will be able to hear me, I hope, yes, I have my earbuds in so it should be fine. Christmas music and we are going to pick up the Christmas tree. nearly at the race course at the moment we are going through the estates which are here at the race course in Newbury 
Uh, yeah, it's quite dark. Hopefully, we'll be Whoa. off. <laughs> and he, he's loving the frost because he's quite slippery and he can slide. So, yeah, he absolutely loves it. Yes? Wow! Sliding! Great! <laughs> wow! It looks quite spectacular, I must say. Well, on the camera I can't really see it properly, but it looks good. just said goodbye to the Christmas carnival at the race course in Newbury uh, it was amazing I didn't talk to you too much while we were there because it was super loud with the Christmas music of course uh, but we had some lovely rides uh, this big wheel although you couldn't see through much through the frozen glass but it was fine in bumper cars which I probably showed you already. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have some bruises on my legs tomorrow. Super fun, great, fresh, hot donuts. Amazing, and lovely. Wow, this is actually so embarrassing. I can't believe that I'm showing you my beauty room in this state but this is the reality after the whole week i am packing up some gift boxes to send out early morning on first thing on monday then cleaning out this some delivery arrived so yeah quite a bit of cleaning so i better start <music> That looks much better. Makes me feel much makes me feel much better. I will put the lights on. So yeah, cleaned everything, put away all the fresh towels, changed bedding so it's all nice and fresh for my first Monday clients. But the thing which I didn't show you is this beautiful parcel which has arrived yesterday but I haven't got a chance to open it and this is a little beautiful Christmas gift from Clamanti Cosmetics oh they always remember and think of me thank you so much Clamanti Cosmetics we have some buzz for the Christmas season we have some little gadgets from the Apis Cosmetics obviously Norel Dr. Wilsch, some Polish sweets which I absolutely love, a little cosmetic bag, oh thank you so much, that's really really thoughtful and so nice and I think that will be it uh, for today, as for this vlog, I will pick up my camera tomorrow because as you can see I look rather disheveled <laughs> after the whole day of activities it was lovely but now it's time to relax have a lovely bath put some masks on my face and get ready for tomorrow for another very intense day in london good morning good morning guys it's 10 o'clock in the morning and everything it's still absolutely frozen wow are we crazy that we're going to London in this kind of weather? I don't know. We will see. So I'm heading over to the train station my usual way. Luckily I live very close to the town centre so it's just a walking distance uh, for me to the train station. 
hopefully everything will be on time and yes I think there will be loads of stops for the hot chocolate and Christmas tea <laughs> in London to warm, warm ourselves up. I am properly wrapped up in a few thermal layers and yeah thermal socks and stuff hopefully that will be enough to keep me warm but yeah this weather wow look how white it is behind me I don't know if you will be able to see it right heading over to the train station Morning. Hello. Hi. Anna is here. We are just checking out our way to the Covent Garden. That will be our first stop for today because we need to warm up because it's freezing. We need a hot coffee or hot tea and some nice breakfast. Anna is just checking the route. <laughs> Christmas lights fill the city There are people everywhere And we have made it. We are in Covent Gardens. Uh, as usual, very, very busy. Ah, still freezing. We need a proper your coffee it's not like I will be moaning in every single clip but it is a bit cold so yeah <laughs> look at Anna behind me all around the up like this right <laughs> as I stroll on my way to you how will you feel about packing up to After a very successful trip to the Covent Gardens, of course I couldn't resist to go and have a look at the Elisa Eldridge makeup collection at her pop-up shop uh, in the Covent Gardens. I told you last time when I've been to the Covent Gardens her previous pop-up wasn't open anymore, but now she has another one, so a lovely lovely shop lovely people working there lovely assistants they've been very really helpful so I picked up a few goodies and uh, now we have decided to come to the Bond Street so another very festive area here in London especially this time of the year and we are using today the Elizabeth line mainly and I must say really really impressed really fast um, very convenient and yeah, really clean as well because everything is pretty new here. So let's go and check out the Bond Street. I'm walking around, feeling free, thinking about what's happened to me from July up to now. Okay, so we are in front of one of the most iconic decorations here at the Bond Street, Chanel and Dior. Looks amazing. So beautiful. We are still waiting for the main lights to light up because it's pretty early. What, what's the time? Three o'clock. Three o'clock, so probably about an hour to go. But it looks pretty impressive already. To realize that I can see it in your eyes, so oh, it's true. I'm so glad you feel it too. Nothing to hide, but falling in love. Guys, can it get any more festive than this? It looks 
just spectacular. Everything here, beautiful, beautiful. It's true, this part of the year has something in store for us. We're falling in love. Summer ended, but we did not. We started something, this thing that we got grew stronger. Each day, we're together. I am one happy person now, got myself some super hot peppermint tea, should keep me warm. And now we are back on the Bond Street, walking back to the Elizabeth Lane, uh, Elizabeth Line, sorry, and heading over to our final destination of the day, to our restaurant for a lovely evening. There is Anna behind me. Cheers! Cheers! <laughs> <laughs> believe that but it just started snowing I don't know how lucky are we Anna look there are some little flakes going on oh my god so magical and on the Bond Street <laughs> crossing sorry a bit of a change of the scenery as we came to the Liverpool Street Bishop's Gate and this is where we are heading over to our final destination uh, for tonight Anna picked the restaurant Anna uh, chose somewhere, the restaurant somewhere here somewhere here around <laughs> Anna picked the restaurant in this beautiful <laughs> building oh my god sorry it's a bit loud here but Look at this, what's behind us, wow, wow, that looks just stunning, beautiful, I don't know where to look, <laughs> it's so amazing, wow, look at those tall buildings behind us, I have to show you like this, amazing, a little bit foggy as well, Misty. So yeah, Ooh, still cold but so beautiful, magical. The Christmas lights fill the city. There are people everywhere. Snow is falling white and pretty as I stroll on my way to you. Hi. What a pleasure because we just met a Polish waitress here at the Duck and Waffles and she gave us one of the first tables. Look at this! Anna, it's amazing. 39 Duck and waffle. Look at this view. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. Amazing. And we already have been given some recommendations what we should get from the menu. So we will definitely check it out tonight. Beautiful. Today.
my ears, like, can you feel that pressure? Yes. <laughs> oh my god, that pressure! Whoa. <laughs> Beautiful! Wow! came out from the restaurant and there is snow it's actually snowing wow we have it all the full experience now heading over to the angry ground Woo. I hope you will be able to see those snowflakes on my heart <laughs> amazing we're heading over to the underground and it's time to finish this beautiful day wow the snow this beautiful day in London I can't believe it snows oh my gosh wow amazing <laughs> Merry Christmas everyone <laughs> and it's time to say goodbye to London and to that beautiful lady Anna we had an amazing time in London today. I think you should visit as well. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas. Bye. And Happy New Year. <laughs> exactly, and Happy New Year. <sighs> so I have just made it back to Newbury. The train journey was really, really smooth and quite quick, 43 minutes, and I am back. Well, this light, it doesn't do me any justice I know but it's quite dark and you wouldn't believe what a weather difference I will try to insert a little photo here what Anna arrived to when she arrived home and she lives other side of London hello and I I'm in Newbury yeah it's a bit misty but nothing more than that and she has a full snowstorm so yeah pretty pretty shocking how different the weather conditions can be nearly at the tunnel so I can talk to you although you can still hear the cars in the background never mind so yeah despite the fact it was freezing down in London minus three minus four sometimes it still was amazing, super Christmassy, super magical. You've seen the Bond Street, the Covent Garden, packed with people, all those Christmassy scents of cinnamon, uh, gingerbread. Yes, I mean, it was uh, glazed apples. Yeah, everything that looked and felt amazing, very Christmassy. I am in such great Christmassy mood right now and yeah quite late in the evening but tomorrow morning I start quite early with my ladies hopefully it doesn't snow too much so the schools remain open and I can work as usual uh, I hope you enjoyed watching my vlogmas number two thank you very much for joining me today uh, for this little Christmas vlog. I wish you all a beautiful festive season and I will talk to you again very very soon. Bye! Oh,